So with the release of the latest patch, Fortnite added a new shotgun to the game. This shotgun, as we all know, is the new tactical shotgun, which is the comes in in epic and rare variants. This shotgun is an absolute beast in terms of damage that can be dealt in one shot, and it comes packed with a good amount of fire rate as well. In this video, we're going to be breaking down the two guns and to help you guys determine which gun you guys would prefer using throughout your gameplay. So let's compare the two guns back to back. The combat shotgun shoots at 148 damage per second, doing 80 damage per shot with a 1.5 headshot multiplier and a 1.85 fire rate. The tactical shotgun shoots at 130 damage per second with 87 damage per shot with a 2.25 headshot multiplier and shooting one and a half times per second. So when comparing the guns, you would imagine that the combat shotgun is a better gun because of its damage per second. But with shotguns, that isn't always the case, especially with the headshot multipliers being so different. The tack shotgun does have a higher damage per second than the pump shotgun when you refer to the old school or the original tacks, like the blue one for instance. It has a higher damage per second, but the pump shotgun has that one shot capability and it also yields a greater damage per shot. So anyone who plays Fortnite will tell you that the pump shotgun is better than the tack shotgun, but this is a new tack shotgun. It's not the same. So for my range test example, I decided to start off from roughly four tiles away, which is a pretty good effective range for the combat shotgun. And as you can see, the combat is hitting for more damage at range with the headshots, yielding 50, 50 to 55 damage per shot and the, com and the attack doing a consistent 18 damage in the head. Now from three tiles away, you'll see that the combat still hits for a very good amount of damage, which is 85, but because its multiplier was reduced, the tack shotgun now hits for pretty close to the same damage. Now for this example, uh, around two tiles away, I couldn't seem to get the headshot to go off, but you'll see that the tack or the combat still hit for 116. Now from one tile away, you'll see that it hits for max damage and the tack shotgun actually hits for more damage when you get one tile away. Now when we move to being right in their face it still hits for the same damage but then you're going to get effectively you're going to get one shotted with the attack shotgun versus the combat that's going to be one of the big differences between the two guns it's going to really come down to play style as you can see the two guns pull out at roughly the same exact speed when i do this test right here you'll see that i'm able to pull out my gun and fire and then at roughly the same exact speed, you'll be able to see that the combat pulls out at the same exact speed. For the two guns, I believe that they've made the same exact time for the pullout time. So in that respect, the two are even testing. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And at, in terms of which gun I would prefer, I honestly think the two guns are fairly even. The tack shotgun does have, like I said, the damage that can be deal, dealt in one shot. Although so does the pump, but since the tack has that a good amount of fire rate, it is honestly a pretty good replacement for this combat shotgun if it were to ever get vaulted. The tack or the combat shotgun obviously is still going to re remain king of the shotguns, but that's because of pure usage and because of the range that it has. In competitive play, I couldn't tell you which one would be used more, but if I were to make a guess, I would say that the combat is still going to be used more because of its range but that does not mean that the attack will not receive a good amount of usage all in all i do enjoy both of the guns i initially was not a fan of the attack shotgun and believed that it would lose to the combat every time but after playing with the gun more i could see how the attack shotgun can actually rival the combat shotgun let me know what you guys think about the video leave a comment down below and if you found this information helpful don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next one peace